Hello, this is Tyagarajan. In this video, I will show you in the first method how to create a frame by frame animation in PowerPoint similar to what we do in most animation software. The smoothness of motion depends on the number of slides we use for creating the animation. In the second method, I apply two motion paths simultaneously on the same object to produce smoother animation which is also called as motion path tweening in other animation software. Now let us create a frame by frame animation. Each slide is a frame for the MPEG4 video we are going to create. Let me use 12 frames in this video. I need a good background picture for my animation video. Go to pixabay.com and search for images. I will choose this image, click on that and click on this pre-download button. You can choose the resolution you need. I will choose 1020 into 1280 and click on this download button. It is downloading. Don't forget to acknowledge the creator. Thanks to Nikki P and Pixabay.com. This is the image. You save this image in the required folder. Now open a new PPT. I delete this. Click on this insert tab. Choose this pictures button and also choose the option this device and insert the picture we have already downloaded. Now you ensure that the picture has been selected. Click on that. Then go to align and choose align left. So the top left corner of the picture will be aligned to the top left corner of the slide. Now you enlarge it so that uh, the image will be covering the complete uh, slide. Save it frame by frame animation like i have saved it now again you go to insert tab click on this pictures button choose the option this device and import the baby picture we already edited now it is available you bring it to the leftmost position now you select the baby picture hold down the control key press the left button of the mouse and drag now you select both the pictures again hold down the control key press left button of the mouse and drag again you select all the four pictures then take a copy then again you hold down the control key click on the left button of the mouse and drag it you will get another four pictures now you select the first picture adjust the distance like this then you adjust the distance of the second picture even it may be overlapping no problem you just reduce the height slightly then take the third one reduce the height of the baby slightly then take the next one reduce the height further and also adjust the position you repeat this for all images Finally, I have adjusted the heights and distances between the 12 baby pictures like this. Now, I duplicate this slide to get totally 12 slides. So, right click, duplicate slide. So, I need 12 slides because I have 12 baby pictures. Now, you select the first slide, leave the first baby picture and select the remaining baby pictures by holding down the control key and pressing the left button of the mouse after selecting all the remaining images just click the delete key then you go to the second slide leave the second baby picture and select the remaining pictures like this and delete them go to third one leave the third baby and remove the remaining pictures you continue this procedure for all slides. Now you go to file tab and go to export options. Choose create video. You leave this as it is full HD. Then you set the seconds spent on each slide as 0.1. If you reduce this time to 0 0.05 then the animation will be faster. If you increase this time then the animation will be slower. After setting this time, click on this create video button, give the name for this video and save it. 
and it will be processing and you go here this is the mp4 file this is the video we got for the animation we created if you need smooth motion in the animation increase the number of baby pictures and the number of slides or use motion paths as i explain now now you take the first frame in the previous animation you delete the remaining frames you select the picture click on the animations tab and click on add animation go to more motion paths and choose the path named right and click ok the picture will move through this path click on the red circle which is the end point of the path and extend the path by left clicking the mouse on the red circle and dragging it now again go to add animation click on this choose more emphasis effects and choose grow shrink animation and click on the ok button now click on the animation pane button the animation pane window will open click on the combo box of the second animation that is grow and shrink animation and choose the effects option from the drop down menu click on the size combo box choose the option tiny now click on the ok button again go to the same animation go to effect option you see the duration is two seconds it is ok similarly you select the first animation that is path animation you select the effect option you select the timing it is also two seconds then you set smooth start and smooth end zero and click on the ok button here also you check it effects of effect option it is also having smooth start and smooth end values zero click on the ok button go to slideshow mode and test the animation now the animation is performed one after another choose the second animation and choose this option start with the previous now you check it here it is going up you adjust the path by bringing down this red circle you can also save this animation as mpeg file go to file tab export it create video then full hd you set this value as 0 0.1 one then create video you can give the name as path screening now you check this the video will play like this if you like this tutorial share with your friends and if you have not subscribed please subscribe